Hey guys, so I'm back with another YouTube video. I know that I've been gone for a minute, but you know, work and everything has just been really, really hard to get this content out. But I wanted to show you guys some products that I got from um, a new Vox box that I got. If you guys follow me on social media, specifically on my Instagram and maybe even my Snapchat, you guys would see that um, I got a Carol's Daughter uh, Vox box for this time around. Um, Influencer actually uh, gave me this whole Carol's Daughter inspired Vox box with their new um, Goddess Strength collection. So I was super excited because I am a natural and um, with me being a natural, I only use natural hair products and things like that. So um, the fact that, you know, Influencer was letting me in on this Vox box, it just shows that they seen the content on my channel and like they really like specifically put me in on this content because they knew that, you know, I would really enjoy it. So, you know, if you guys do want to sign up for Influencer, it's a free app and you pretty much just get a chance to like um, review products that you actually use, that you actually like, and just review them. So, um, this video is not sponsored by them or anything. It's just, uh, you know, I'm just trying to help you guys out because if you guys want free products and things like that, um, that are pretty much things that you like to use on a daily basis, then, you know, you can go ahead and go and, you know, get the app, you know what I'm saying? So, um, I'm going to stop talking and rambling and just show you all the contents that they got me, okay? Um, the first thing that they got me is um, a shampoo with the conditioner to match. Um, and this whole Vox box is going to consist only of four products, but it is the whole kind of like line of the Carol's Daughter New Goddess Strength um, brand. So, this is the packaging of it. And I was extremely surprised of the sizing of this. This is 11 ounces of uh, shampoo and conditioner each. Um, I don't know if you guys can see, but I've used this twice so far. I've used way more of the conditioner than I have of the shampoo. Um, but a little bit of these products go a long ways. And I just want to say, shout out to this shampoo. Guys, I don't know, like, if I've raved about, like, there's so many products that I do want to rave about because there's so many products that I'm like, oh my God, I have to tell them this product. I have to explain to them this product. But um, there's a specific shampoo from a specific brand that I really, really love. And I was like, I don't know if anybody could beat this brand. And I'm thinking about doing a review on that one so you guys could, like, see. But, guys, when I tell you that this shampoo is amazing, it has great slip. Um, a great lather like I love my shampoos to have a really good lather um, and really good slip so then that way when I go in with conditioner I'm literally just putting the conditioner on and it's going through like butter you know what I'm saying so that's what I like um so this shampoo says it's for weak breakage prone hair which you know I do need that because I do get lots of breakage and stuff um and sometimes my hair could be a little weak because I don't deep condition and things like that as often as I used to. So my hair do be a little bit fragile. And um, it also says no sulfates, no parabens, and no artificial colors, which I love that stuff. That's all the good stuff. Like if you are a natural or a new natural, those are things that you don't want to be in your products, okay? Um, and then it's made with castor oil, ginger, black cumin seeds. So those are really good products as well that are made within this and the smell on all of these products I'm going to tell you right now it's a nice smell to me because I really love the smell of it you could definitely smell the ginger but um, I will tell you guys this right now these products are really extremely um, strong um, so if you easily get like lightheaded from like the smells of uh, like really strong smells this might not be the smell for you but um, the way that the product works overall is very very good um but uh it is very very strong and i'm talking like it's so strong that you could have used it during wash day and it's probably going to stay within your hair for a couple of days maybe even about a week 
So yeah, it's pretty strong. On to the conditioner, guys. So the conditioner, I feel like I do have to use a lot more of this than I do have to use of the shampoo. The shampoo, I feel like um, if your hair is really wet and if you're applying it, you should be really good and you shouldn't have to keep uh, reapplying it um, or re-getting pumps of the shampoo. But as far as the conditioner, um, it's conditioner, so you know, um, I think normally we use more conditioner than we use of shampoo. Um, but it's made with all the same things um, as far as like the ingredients. But this one says it has no parabens, no petroleum, no mineral oil, and no artificial um, colors. I'm just now seeing that um, the shampoo doesn't say anything about the petroleum or mineral oil, but the conditioner does. So maybe that's a couple things that you guys want to think about. Me, I'm not too big on um, ingredients like that. Like as long as it doesn't have the big, big stuff like sulfates and stuff like that um, and alcohol, then I'm pretty much good, you know, with products and stuff. Um, but yeah, so it pretty much has the same thing, same smell, same size. Um, it's just this one's the conditioner. And I, let me tell you guys, the conditioner is just as good. Um, the conditioner had great slip. I'm talking about it's very softening. They did not send me a deep conditioner, so I don't know if this line comes with a deep conditioner or not, but I use the conditioner kind of as a deep conditioner because it does say that you could leave it on your hair for five to seven minutes. So I just left it on my hair for about five to seven minutes. And if I did go a little bit over five to seven minutes, I didn't really make it a big deal. And, um... I just you know kept it at that or whatever but uh yeah it was really good um i'm actually reading here it does say that you could use it as a mask and leave on for five to seven minutes so yeah like they didn't have a deep conditioner because they said that you could use the conditioner and it just makes wash day so much easier to use all of the same products. Keep this on my hair for five to seven minutes, rinse it out real quick, and then boom, style. Because lately I've been an extremely lazy natural. Like I'm telling you guys, like um, such a lazy natural that I sat there and I was going to wear a twist out today because I was trying to trim my ends and stuff. And I haven't done a twist out in so long. Had nice, thick, juicy twists and everything, but... I was trying to do the takedown process this morning and I knew I should have stopped because once I felt my hair, it was very wet. But instead of me stopping, I was like, no, I'm gonna do it anyway. And I now have to wear my hair in like a little puff pineapple. So I'm a little upset because I should have stopped, but I've been a lazy natural lately, guys. So, sorry. On to the leave-in conditioner. Now, um, on here it says that it is the Divine Strength Leave-In Cream. Um, so, here is my thoughts on this. Um, and this one as well is just like the uh, conditioner with no parabens, petroleum, mineral oil, and artificial colors. But um, here is my, and this one actually also says 94% less breakage. So the other one says one use, 15 times stronger hair. Um, and this one has says 94% less breakage. So um, my only problem with this is that um, this is a leave-in cream. So I was thinking that it was going to be a thicker consistency and have a better hold, especially with my um, initial first time using it. I was thinking that I was just going to get away with only using the line and that was about it and I didn't have to use any outside uh, like products to pair with this brand but um, I'm telling you guys right now this is not a leave-in cream there is nothing about this that is uh, thick and creamy this is um, good with slip and everything same smell but it is not a cream. You will need to use a cream with this if you want your product, I mean, if you want your hairstyle to last. Because I feel like um, with me just using this leave-in conditioner and no cream with it, um, I had frizz because I didn't really have much hold 
So yeah, unless you have finer hair, um, you're going to want to use the cream to go along with this. My hair is much more thicker, uh, so I can't get away with just using this leave-in cream um, on my hair. I have to use something thicker with this to have the hold that I want. Because my curls would have been amazing today because I paired it with the Body by Eden um, um, cream. It's, it's one of the creams. The one with the gray cap to it, the Body by Eden one. That is one of my favorite products right there. Like, I really love that one. I'm possibly going to do a review on it or something. But um, a really good product, too. Um, but, yeah. This is... Out of five stars on Influencer, I gave it a four because... The fact that that deceived me because I thought it was going to be a leave-in cream and thicker so then all that I had to use was this line but no it deceived me on that so I had to give it a four out of five stars instead of five out of five but everything else got five out of five and lastly I want to talk about their oil so uh, the, the oil here instead of it saying the phrases that the other one says it says no way down which this is actually telling the truth this is a very, very light um, oil. It honestly almost reminds me of jojoba oil because of how light it is. Um, but it's probably just a little thicker than jojoba oil. But uh, yeah, it is for weak, breakage-prone hair um, made, with black, made with castor oil and black cumin seed. Um, it says no petroleum, mineral oil, or artificial colors. Once again, it has the same smell to it. Um, and my first way that I used this was I um, put it on my hands and used it while I was styling with the leave-in cream because I was like, well, if this is all that I'm using, I might as well add it with the oil. Um, and then, you know, uh, for the takedown process, of course, I also used the oil. Um, and yeah, I just really love the oil. It was a typical oil. Um, so yeah, it wasn't, uh, anything too crazy. I'm not going to read off all the, um, ingredients and everything, but just know that it has really, really great ingredient, ingredients. I'm sorry. It has really, really great ingredients. And, um, yeah, it's just, it's no animal derived ingredients in this as well. My initial thoughts on this line. My initial thoughts is I am, of course, going to buy this once I do run out, especially of the leave-in conditioner and the um, shampoo. The shampoo, by far, was the best of this entire line, and uh, that was the number one thing that I loved. I felt like the shampoo was so great that at points it felt like relaxing while I was lathering it within my hair, and... Um, the one thing that I disliked about the entire line was the end cream because for one, it deceived me because I thought it was going to be thicker consistency and uh, be able to hold my style, but it wasn't, which it's not too big of a deal for me because I can always just pair it with something else. But other than that, this line is great and I do recommend it. Um, make sure you guys uh, tag me if you guys use it and um yeah just sign up for influencer to get free vox boxes because it's a, a good deal in the end you know so um i also am going to leave um probably some affiliate links in the comments below so you guys please check my description box um i might look around and shop for you guys so then that way you guys can get a direct link to find these products or something similar um, I also have my social media links below in the description box and um, ways of contacting me for business inquiries. Um, and just if you need any other info, just please read the description box. So yeah, go ahead and give this video a like. Um, go ahead and subscribe and comment to let me know that you want more videos and what other videos you want to see. Um, alright guys, so I think that is it. Um, I hope everybody enjoys their day, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!